Yes, it's a it's been a very emotional scene here today at the Cumberland County Sheriff's Office after one of its own deputies was killed in the line of duty very early this morning. Again, his name was Oscar Giovanni Bolanos Anavisca. The 24 year old deputy was hit by a drunk driver after he was responding to a robbery at a Circle K on Gillespie Street here in Fayetteville. Bolanos was returning from running a canine unit crossing the street when 24 year old Nicholas Terlizzi hit him with his car and Bolanos later died of his injuries at Cape Fear Valley Medical Center. Now, Terlizzi left the scene but was later found by authorities and he was given felony charges for death by vehicle and hit and run as well as misdemeanor charges for driving under the influence, reckless endangerment, failure to stop at a red light and driving without registration, liability insurance and with a revoked license. In fact, records we found at the Cumberland County Court of Clerks detail a long list of dismissed charges with Cumberland County, including speeding, uh, driving, with a license uh, that's been revoked while not impaired, violating domestic violence protective orders and other traffic violations that stretch back to 2017. Cumberland County Sheriff uh, Ennis Wright condemned the suspect for endangering others on the road earlier today at that press conference. You know, I look at it as uh, a senseless uh, tragedy that was uh, could have been prevented. Um, what well, we have folks out here drinking and driving on these roadways. You know, we had a, a young officer out there doing his job, what he loved to do, what he wanted to do. And his life was taken away so quickly. Dozens of Bolano's family members came out today to mourn and to attend the press conference. None of them wanted to speak just yet. It's, it really has been just such a sad day here in Cumberland County. In Fayetteville, Monique John, ABC 11 Eyewitness News.